At NDSU, we recommend producers remove net wrap before processing and feeding forages to their livestock. Cattle may eat the net wrap if it's not removed. Eating excessive amounts of net wrap can result in livestock illness and deaths. A study NDSU Animal Sciences Department researchers conducted on several hay bale binding materials found that the three types of net wrapping and the biodegradable twine they evaluated had not disappeared 14 days after cattle ate hay with those wrappings. Well, the ones that we have found that have um, bale wrap in them, uh, it, it's, it's easy to see. It looks like it looks like netting. It looks like mesh netting in the room, and, and we've had you know uh, small chunks, big chunks. Um, it, it just depends upon, I suppose, you know, if they chop the hay or if they just drop them out there and let them eat off of it. And I think, you know, the um, the number of animals exposed might depend a little bit upon individual animals. Some of them may just get into more of it than others. Well, I think they, um, the ones that we've had that have come in here that we think have, have died from that have, you know, have quite a, um, a mass of that wrap balled up in their rumen. And, and we think it just shuts down their gastrointestinal system and makes their rumen static. And they just basically um, don't digest well. And so they look like they're going on feed. They stand off to the side. Um, and so, you know, I think they're obviously looking like they have a belly ache and they have a problem. And, and so those, the ones that we've had have, bloat, have bloated up and, and come in dead. And we Removing net wrap can be difficult and time consuming, but with bread heifers selling for $3,200 and 500 pound steers selling for $1,500, removing net wrap before processing and feeding forages is worth the effort.